We made it. Hyperspace jump complete. All systems nominal and the quantum wave effect has dissipated. We have missed jumped. The support ship is not here. Fleet command will signal the car salim while we confirm our current position. This is the mothership calling support vessel car salim. Come in please. We have missed jumped and are requesting your beacon. This is the mothership calling support vessel car salim. Please respond. Commencing Corvette drive research. Priority alert. We have picked up the Car Slim's automated beacon. Send a probe to make contact and re-establish communications. Okay, and after all that, I gotta finally get a word in edgewise. Hey viewers, welcome back to Let's Play Homeworld. This is the second map, the outskirts of the Karak system. And as we last left off, this was the mothership's first jump, and it's not going so well. So, what I've done now is retire all of my scouts. What we're going to do instead is build one probe, because we need it for the mission, and then build a ton, or one at a time, of these guys. Production underway. Interceptors. Now, you probably saw me get to work on... Probe complete. Jeez, Fleet Command. Getting to work on researching Corvettes. We have a couple Corvette items to research this level, but here's something interesting. And actually, a commentator had mentioned this in the very first mission. Homeworld is very trigger-driven. So, what we're supposed to do is send a probe there. And what we're going to do instead is... Well, not, basically. Well, maybe we should. I'm debating how best to do this. You know what? I think we will once, will once those interceptors are made. If I don't actually complete all of the mission goals in the order they're given to me, I can essentially strip mine this map without ever having to deal with the final fight. Which will make the final fight much easier because I'll have a lot more guys. In fact, I think that's what I'm going to do. Corvette drive research complete. Yes, yes. Repair Corvette available for construction. Corvette class ships require a power plant of this size. So, Corvette chassis gives us light Corvettes. Commencing Corvette chassis research. And we are never going to build one, viewers. Never ever. So we're just going to... Well, let's scale it back one there. Reporting. 15 ought to be a pretty good number to start. So once I send that probe over here to the car Salim, well, spoilers viewers, we're gonna get attacked. I know, in an RTS game. Shocking. But I would like to beef up my defenses at first and also Thank you. get my that research ship the heck out of here. So we won't be exposed. How are we doing on those interceptors? Eight more. Now, someone in the head actually asked for a close-up. Ready for orders. So, Reporting. focus. Here is the Kushan interceptor. Fair bit blockier than the scout. Same visual armament, at least, but definitely more heavily armored. And we've got Reporting a salvage corvette here, which we already saw. Pretty good modeling for 1999. Good texturing too. And let's zoom in on the research ship. Unless we have an indentation for an airlock there and an airlock on this side, that demonstrates how these guys actually end up joining together and form essentially a donut of research. Science viewers. And then of course we have the research ship again, which I didn't mean to do. We have our resource collector. Busily mining rocks, gas clouds, shrinking rocks, and of course it's got this little bar there that fills up on delicious ore to make delicious weapons of destruction. 
Four more. Okay, you know what? By the time they get here... Well, what the heck, I'll the tactical overlay on, but... There we go. Probe dispatched. Now, probes are extremely fast and actually very heavily armored for how they look. In fact, they have, yeah, 800 armor, and my interceptors have probably 160. But enough for me, viewers. Mothership is under attack. Engage incoming units. The mothership must be defended. Probe in position. Welcome to the first enemies of the game, viewers. The Tyrannic Raiders. It's, it's not pretty clear they were responsible for taking out the Karsalim. Group 1 to combat stations. Attack complete. Holding pattern locked in. Locked on target. Fortunately, as you can see, they're not terribly powerful. I'm probably going to lose a ship or two, but... Cells full, we're coming back. Target acquired. Group 1 under attack. No attack. Salvage Corvette, get in there. Target selected for salvaging. Group one copies. The mothership is under fire. Oh, whatever, I'm not worried. Yes, technically you can try and salvage these things, but it's usually doesn't work very well. Kind of fact, they are still more maneuverable. Collector under attack. Nice. Let's see if I can actually get in there. Acknowledged. More than likely, Mothership will just take it out. So, Group one receiving. just finish it. Attack clearance received. Yeah, you can see Mothership nailing it dead on. Hostile units destroyed. Threat eliminated. So you Mothership say. sustained minor hull damage. Repairs are underway. Resourcer under attack. Oh, it's fine. The Karsalim has been destroyed. Heavy weapon damage is visible on the remaining fragment. A salvage corvette must be sent to retrieve the mission data recorder. Now, I've got these guys docking to repair them. And I have some units to build and a couple of things to flesh out. And... This is the point where we can basically mine the entire map, and the next trigger won't happen until I send that salvage corvette to the Karsalim. So, with that in mind, Awaiting orders. I'm going to send the salvage corvette over there, because as long as I don't actually harvest it, Under nothing attack. happens. Or harvest it. Salvage it. In the meantime, I will harvest the rest of the map. Throw in a couple more interceptors and start planning ahead, because... I know it's coming on the next map, viewers. So, we will see you back shortly. 
Just a little quick break for you. Probably more like 15, 20 minutes for me. Another good reason to build more salvaging or resource collectors. Time management viewers. See you in a bit. Wall formation confirmed. Hey viewers, welcome back. I've Assuming finished formation. harvesting the map, and as you can see, I've got a lot more interceptors now. Waiting assignment. I'm going to continue with the plot. Acquired. You'll also notice a uh, red dot up there. That's going to come into play very shortly. Actually, is that dust cloud not salvageable? Resuming. Yes, also a load more salvage corvettes. Collection underway. Hmm. Okay, maybe there is something. Group one reporting. Come on, salvage corvette. Ready for orders. Do your thing. Priority alert. Additional hostile units detected on an intercept course with the car Slim. Protection of the salvage team is a primary objective. It must return to the mothership with the mission recorder. We need that data. Target destroyed. Entering holding pattern. Target confirmed. There it goes. It's an enemy carrier. They appear to be reinforcing their squadrons of fighters and corvettes with it. Yeah, but we don't really want a part of that carrier. Unlike the carriers we're gonna get, the Tyrannic Raider Corvette gets an ion cannon. And other things to play with. Target acquired. So, despite what not Fleet Command, but our advisor told us, they kind of out tech us in that regard. Unfortunately, these guys are completely focused on my little salvage corvette that's running away. Attack clearance received. Group one under attack. Locked on target. Bit of a furball there. Attack complete. Entering holding pattern. Underway. Oh, I guess I missed a bit of resource there. If that thing doesn't get attacked. Destination confirmed. Keep moving, interceptors. Not quite fast enough. Target acquired. That thing's toast. Group one reporting group enemy one, contact. Group one, group one, Target destroyed. Holding pattern locked in. I'll take a fight, everybody. Do it. Reporting for duty. Locked on target. Responding. Kind of need to zoom in like this. I'm sure there's a chase camera, but... Group one. No, they're determined. Gotta give them that much. Looks like my poor little resourcer. Trying to sneak by here. Target confirmed. Oh, they snuck one by me. Attention Available resources consumed. Oh. Did you get anything out of that? Reporting. No. Okay. I thought I was done. Salvage team dock safely. Downloading mission data recording. Replaying last entry. Destination locked in. What do you mean you detect a hyperspace entry? The mothership isn't due, but... Sir, I have multiple contacts on closing vectors. Unknown profiles. No recognition codes. Uh... They're not ours. Well, if they're not ours, who the hell are they? Sir, they're coming in fast. Check. Incoming fire. We are under attack. They're getting through. Breaches across all decks. Hull integrity failing. Cast a limb to mothership if you are receiving a bolt hyperdrive test. Repeat, a bolt hyperdrive test. Okay. 
ten years to come this far out, and then that's what happens. Ooh, too far down. Up we go. On our way. Yeah, I didn't quite want to be that far <laughs> south of the mothership. We are detecting enemy units advancing on our position. Organize a defensive force to protect the mothership. I like to fight around the mothership, even though occasionally my interceptors might scrape some paint off by being a little overzealous. But the nice thing about it is the mothership's guns, while not terribly accurate against fighters, do really well against corvettes. Salvage corvettes work really well on frigates and up. The fighters' corvettes generally too maneuverable to actually get tagged by them. But if you are an incredibly patient person, starting on this level, you can actually wait until the enemy fighters and corvettes run out of fuel. They are bound by the same rules that our fighters are, at least in terms of actual mechanics for the most part. So you could run them out of juice. Mothership. I don't think anyone has that kind of time. I know I don't. Let's get in there. Boom. 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 Let's deal with these fighters first. Since the mothership can't. Hey. Wait. Oh crap, that's a salvage corvette. Attack clearance received. I thought it was. I know the Tranic Raiders have a couple ships to do double duty, but... <laughs> blink, blink. Blink. Target blink. Destroyed. Yeah, there it goes. We have determined that these enemy units are inferior to ours. Ah, there's the comment. Protect against penetration of the Karak system. Destroy the attacking force completely. Target acquired. Now you can't actually do that because the carrier will retreat if you Target go after it directly. And sadly you can't capture it either, unless you actually modify the game, which is kind of interesting because the carrier's got decent firepower with that ion cannon on it I mentioned. Flip and boom. Contact complete. Entering holding pattern. Oh, you guys are determined. I'll give you that much. Engaging. <laughs> Throwing pebbles. Deadly mass driver pebbles. This is group one. We have incoming. Contact clearance received. Now, the enemy should retreat. Which are a few more of these guys. I think there they go now. Locked on target. Oh, maybe not. Maybe they're still just dueling me. Target confirmed. This is Group 1. We're low on fuel. Target acquired. Group How 1 copies. How low on fuel are you? We're low on fuel reporting. Ah, you got enough to finish this fight off. receive it. Attack complete. Intercept course 
punched in. This is Group 1. We're running out of juice here. You're fine. Group 1. We're running out of juice here. We're running out of juice here. We're running out of fire target confirmed. Man, I really gotta turn off some of this idle chatter, I think. It's a little much. Locked on target. Engaging. This is Group 1. Coasting fuel, we're drawing out. Yeah, you can feel as soon as these guys retreat. Yeah, I definitely gotta turn on the. Hang on a second. Uh, do 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 do. It's getting kind of annoying. Battle chatter. Turn it down a bit. Except. Group one reporting. Target acquired. A little less whiny now, hopefully. I'm targeting the Corvettes, hoping these guys will run away if I hurt them badly enough. Oh yeah, there they go. Docking with mothership initiated. They're running. Enemy units are retreating. Objectives complete. Stand by for immediate return to Karak. Group 10. Group 8. Group 9. Awaiting assignment. Standing by. And you and you. Group 7, designated. Group 7, group seven copies, copies. Excellent. So, I now have four groups of two salvage corvettes. For anyone that's curious, two corvettes is what you need to capture a frigate. And, hey, spoilers, but I'm pretty sure most of the viewers watching this have already played the game, but we're going to need them very shortly. Actually, I feel pretty comfortable with just hyperspacing out now, since I've double-checked I've held my, my resources. So I'll save here. And off we go. Auto-docking. Hyperspace initiated. Probes are one shot, so that guy gets to stay where he went. Analysis of wreckage reveals the hostile units are using strike craft ranging from fighters to combat corvettes. All pilots will be briefed in case hostiles have penetrated farther into the Karak system. On our return to Karak, the final outfit of the mothership must be accelerated in order to defend against possible future attacks. Many major mothership systems are still incomplete. We will notify Karak's missile defense system of this possible threat. The mothership will then dock with the scaffold for repairs. Stand by for hyperspace exit to Karak. All ships auto launching. All right, and with that. We're on to the next map, the return to Karak. And we'll see you next time, viewers, on Let's Play Homeworld. This map is a bit of a rough one, and not just tactically speaking. We'll see you then.